All right. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So we uh, went through some technical difficulties there. Apologize. Uh, I guess that game was just too hardcore. Need to up the uh, need to up the uh, speed on these computers here. You'd think they'd be powerful enough, but they're not. All right, so I do want to make it up for you. So today's stream, something I've been wanting to do, is called the eBay stream. And we go around eBay and we look at all the ripoffs and all the things people are trying to pass off in the community. And uh, we see, you know, what, what's, what are some good ones? What are some bad ones? Well, let's, uh, let's see what we find. There's a live search on eBay right now, Raspberry Pi 3. Let's see what we get. Um, hope everyone's having a good Friday. What I was trying to do with the video before was play the new Quake uh, Champions. It looks pretty cool. I played a couple games. You got the railgun, the rocket launcher. It brings back all the good, good feelings of Quake 3. Um, really good graphics. It runs great without the stream. With the stream, unfortunately, I'm sorry. I'm not able to share it with you guys. So, uh, moving forward, let's, let's check out some things here. Okay, so these kits, I mean, you know, you got you to gotta see what exactly you're getting. Because the thing with bundling is people tend to bundle with either things that are of not very good quality, uh, or they make it seem like you're getting something amazing, and it's like a piece of tape, you know, or something that, you know, is, is not valuable at all. And they're buying it in bulk, so they're getting it for next to penny. So um, I'm not going to go into all these different kits. Uh, Raspberry Pi 3. Okay, they, they, people definitely tried them. Like, okay, this one right here. Okay, here we go. Here's one that I'm wondering about. So they're saying it's from $89.99 to $189.99. What, what can I choose? What are my options here? Ooh, gaming. Gaming plus the controller. So the 8 bit -o controller. And you get a pie, and you get, let's see what else you get. What's, what's the deal here? Listed as a complete Raspberry Pi 3 with pre-installed retro gaming system. Ooh, what, do you, what does that mean? Okay, you get a media system. Wow, they installed Kodi for you guys. Can you believe this best eBay seller ever? And uh, Linux server. No OS, no, et I don't get this. No OS, no OS thing, huh? We'll see, we'll see about that. Okay, what else we got? Ooh, this one I picked. I think it's coming down here, and it was, yeah, it was this one right here. 64 gigabyte micro SD card with recall box, 15,000 games. Wow, so you're telling me that something I can download for free on the internet, you're gonna sell me $48. Now let's. Let's not get it twisted. He's going to give us the SD card too. People, don't do this. Don't buy it. You know, the, the, all you need is Win32 and you can transfer these over. On a new 64... Okay, so they are giving you Sandus Ultra. So let's actually, let's look how much on Amazon, how much a 64 gigabyte costs right now. Whoa. Okay, he's giving us the, did I say Samsung? Oh, this is extreme. I don't want this stream. They're giving me this one right here, the Ultra. 2440. And when I can buy it on eBay for $48 because it has a free image that you can download online on it. Awesome. Great deals on eBay. All over, all over. Okay. Um, you get a 16 gigabyte gaming kit. Okay, we looked at that one, we looked at that one. Let's look at this one. All right, look at those NES controllers, awesome. We already know those are extremely cheap. LAN cable, very cheap, HMI cheap, cheap case. These little things are like 10 bucks. Yeah. I mean, they just bundle it to make it seem like you're getting a lot of stuff. Download the pre-made image for Raspberry Pi, click here, okay. So they're telling you to go on GitHub and make your own. Yeah, they made it clear. No pre-installed games. All right. What else do we got? 
Okay, more kits, more kits. Latest Raspberry Pi 3. What? $400, guys. $400 for a one-of-a-kind Raspberry Pi 3, 3D printed. And I just got to tell you right now, this is a ripoff. Because, <laughs> because seriously, uh, this, it's not a collectible. It's 3D printed, so you can make it yourself. Sure, there's some, you know, some, some, I mean, that doesn't even look that good. What do you guys think? So it's an SNES wannabe, and uh, I have a custom, one-of-a-kind mini NES with a Raspberry Pi 3 inside, 16 gigabyte card with the operating system loaded, both RetroPie and Kodi, ready to go. Comes with one USB controller, power cord, and an HDMI cable. Why spend tons of money on mini classic systems? You know, tons of money, because you know the Nintendo Classic was only $69.99. But you know why not pay four hundred dollars instead of sixty nine ninety nine, and have a one of a kind set that plays all the classical consoles and has Cody installed? Can you believe it, guys? Cody is installed. All right, this is the best deal. Let's buy it. This was made with a three D printer, trimmed, sanded, filled, sanded, primed, then painted. All right, we got to give this guy a little credit. He made the design. He printed it. He did all that little hard work. Is that hard work? worth four hundred dollars i don't know let's uh let's add this to my watch list let's see if this ever sells okay all right moving along people moving along all right what else do we have raspberry pi 3 lcd touchscreen kit okay adafruit and a lot of companies make that so this is that same guy who wanted to sell us with the sd card right same guy and uh yeah, I know my hard work didn't pay off with Quake. Sorry, got him, bro. Uh, this guy, this guy, not this guy, this guy. So this guy now is selling you no SD card, no physical items. He is selling you a Google link to go and download an image that is readily available. Alone. Awesome. This is awesome right here, people. So we got... This is a download only, not an SD card. Awesome. So I'm basically paying you for something free. Oh, this is this is great. Okay. Play retro games and watch TV on your Raspberry Pi 3 with recall box with Cody. Everyone's always like, with Cody. It's like, guys, Cody is not a big deal. You could get Cody fairly easily. Uh, it's an add-on on the Pi. Easy stuff. This is a digital download only. Thank you, dude. You will receive a Google Drive download link sent to your PayPal email after the payment is free. Thanks, dude. Thanks for sending me something that I can get for free all over the internet. And you still have to use all the 7 zip like you're saying here. Games installed. Look at this. Dang. 1,100 main games. You must pay in 48 hours. Some games may, <laughs> some games may not work or have some sound issues. Wow. He doesn't even stand behind his product over here. He didn't even go through the image and test the games. This is awesome. Great work, dude. Um, due to the nature of the download and potential errors with the SD cards, I will not accept return. Okay, man. Whatever you say. All right. So, Dr. Dougal's way to go. 390 feedback. But people like it. People like spending money for something you can get for free. Great. What about this one? Check out this one. 16 gig micro SD card for Raspberry Pi 2 and 3. Libre Elect. Stream your favorite movie. And I got to give this guy props because he like updated it with the latest videos. Like Logan's fairly new, Get Out, Ghost in the Shell just released. So this guy is like advertising to all the people out there who want the latest and the greatest. Look at this, one view per hour. One view per hour. Like that's not nothing. Uh, ditch your cable and stream your favorite movie. Titanium Krypton 1.8 installed on the Libre Elect Cody 17.1 on a new 16 gigabyte Ultra SD card for Raspberry Tire 3. All right. So again, something you should be able to get online and do yourself. And the 16 gigabyte SD card, is he even giving you a name brand? Does he even say what you get? Sandus Ultra. All right, so we get a 16 gig Sandus Ultra. Let's see what we're, got. we're, we're rocking over here. Uh, Eleven, ten dollars, ten dollars. So he's giving us something we can buy for ten dollars. 
for 25. Why not? Why not? Just 25 bucks. Not bad. All right. So far, we've been finding killer deals here on eBay. Let's keep it going. Yeah, it is more than most true talks guy. Yeah, you, the magic man says you got to have some good bait. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That guy's image was good clickbait, right? You're like, oh man, it's got it's got those latest movies, Ghost in the Shell. Oh, that's so cool. I got to click on this. So some more kits. Wow, this guy's got $130. Okay, he actually has like the GPS. Okay, so he's got some adapters on there. That same guy, guys, who is selling the 16 gigabyte image, sells a 64 gigabyte image, no SD card, just an image that you can readily download. 64 gig, $8. So he charges a little more money here, guys. He's charging a little money. So if you want the 16, it's like about $5, but you want that 64 gigabyte image that you can get for free, it's gonna cost you. It's gonna cost you $7.90, people. $7.90. This guy is hardcore. He's saying just a little more, just a little more, get a few more games. This is how it works, people. If you want more games, you give more money, just like the mafia, you know? That's, that's how things work, okay? Who else we got here? Okay. Oh, we got another one. We got another guy. She's using the Transformers as clickbait. I'm already enticed. Wow. Wow, look at this, guys. Wow. Gear TV, Mucky. For Razor Talk. Okay, okay, this is the movie guy again. So the movie guy's added again with a 16 gigabyte and Gears of War installed on it. All right. All your favorite movies, Transformers, you name it, $16. Okay, so this guy's got like a business. Nothing against this guy. This is just really expensive, $360. And he's sponsoring it too, so he's paying eBay to get higher on the search results here. Now that's kind of cool, um, but it's pretty freaking expensive. 360 what do you guys think? Is it worth $360? Or something you can build yourself. All right. Yeah, it costs you money just for a link. Yeah, my chat's going crazy over here because they're like, you know, they give you it. So they don't they don't give you a physical product. They just give you a link. And with that link, you still have to go and do all the work yourself uh, to do that. Preloaded 16 gigabyte. Okay, so here's another one. He's preloading it. 16 gigabyte. 24 hour response time. Wow, look at that, guys. This guy actually is differentiating himself. Expert setup. We put hours and hours into our software configuration. Do you hear that, guys? Hours and hours. Hours and hours. They're not getting it from Emulation Station. They're not getting it from all those other developers. But they themselves are doing hours and hours of software configuration. Wow, just wow. Quality assured. All right, thanks. After service, guaranteed. Best cost performance. Pre-installed emulators. Wow, look at that. You get all those systems. Wow, just so cool. Attention. Wow, they don't even give you the Raspberry Pi. Are you joking me? This this hundred this I thought for 50 bucks I'd at least get a Raspberry Pi. This is for everything but the Pi. To not include it. So you <laughs> you still have to buy a Raspberry Pi. All right, great. That was crappy. Okay, this guy thinks he's gonna get $86 for his Raspberry Pi. What is this guy smoking? What? You could go buy a brand new can of kit, dude. What, what's going on here? And that's like the can of kit case. Dude, dude, what's wrong with eBay people? Wow, do people buy this stuff? Do people buy this stuff? Like, what's going on here? What's going on here? Okay, all right, moving along, moving along. What else we got here? Come on, but I mean, this we gotta we gotta step up this game here. Okay, more kits, more kits. Wow, look at these diagrams. Such diagrams. Oh, thirty-two gig. So this guy's got the thirty. He's got the sixteen. He's got the thirty-two, and he's got the sixty-four gig. And you can do it with or without the SD card, people. So thirty-two gigabyte SD card. Let's just double check the price on that, people. Let's just see what kind of markup this guy's doing. Brand new 32 gig ultra, $14, $14. Okay, so $14, how much does he wanna charge us? $38, great, plus shipping, plus shipping guys. So $16, he's making $22 off of a free download. Great, that's awesome. 
that saw us, five available. The thing is, I was looking at this guy's stuff and there's people that actually bought, let's just look at what, what all this guy's selling here. Okay, he's got 12 items for sale, 12 items. Oh, he's the same guy selling the Cody kits. I didn't realize that. Okay, so this is like the one guy conquering it. 42 people are watching this. 42 people. 42 people watching this. Okay. Yeah, exactly, people. You guys are smart in the chat. You know what's up. But this guy, 6448. You get the 16, it's 590. I, I wonder where he came up with this pricing. And then 32, $1 more, twice as much. One dollar actually only three thousand more games, but and then when you go up to the sixty-four gig, you get the fifteen thousand five hundred and eighty-nine. Wow. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not gonna ask him anything because he's gonna get all you know, he's not gonna answer uh anything. And then if you want it on an SD card. Oh, this one comes with a thumb drive too. Nice. This guy's got all of his bases covered. He's not doing the 128 though. What's up with that, man? <clears throat> That's where your margins are. If you think about it, those are where your margins are. Yeah, I should delete my quake videos here. Give me a second here. My crappy videos. Sorry for my crappy videos. I'm making up for it here. delete okay i had to delete my other videos there all right thank you got him bro for reminding me all right so we're just doing ebay uh let me know what you guys think about that handheld do you think it's worth 300 i mean what's that worth i mean you can build right you can get a you could get like an old game boy right and do all the work yourself. what the heck is this guy selling home cloud server Okay, so we we refer we've already know that that other guy's a crook, POS, Doctor Doodles. I kind of want to buy it just to see what's on it, but I'm sure he just took somebody else's recall box image that's out there and re-uploaded it. So is it worth five dollars? I don't know, just to kind of see what's up. So oh, okay, so this guy sells it with a hard drive. Okay, so he basically turns your Pi into a server, which is that's great, dude. I'm sure he has some script. He gets it all set up. You get the Pi, and it's all set up to store all your files. Pretty smart. Okay, what else we got here? Four in one Raspberry Pi module, case, fan, and heatsink. All right. There's that thing is sponsored. They really want me to buy it. You know, I clicked on it so that probably the, the algorithm is like, oh, we got to show it to this guy another five times. I mean, okay, what's this, guys? Just a, just a picture of a Super Nintendo controller, $140. Let's see what's going on there. Raspberry Pi 3 message board chat file sharing anonymous DIY 4chan private box. Wow. I just want to click in there really quick. 32 gigabyte class 10 only. Okay, the bone to install on it. Maybe I should undercut him by selling one dollar. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm good. I don't host images and I don't distribute them. I simply show you the way it's it's in your it's in your, the ball is in your court, not mine. These guys are profiting from people who are doing hard work. It's an open source community. Keep it open source, man. There's this guy again. All right, so what was the other one that we clicked on? All right, we saw that one. Okay, Raspberry Pi 3 based. Raspberry Pi 3 based retro games emulation console retro Pi 4.2 and Cody 17 with two SNES type controllers, guys. SNES type controllers. I mean, I got it from China and it's probably only a couple dollars each, but they're SNES type controllers. Yeah. This is all in one retro gaming emulation console. It will play all your favorite games on your HDTV. Do you believe that people? It's not our CRT TV. 
It's our HD TV, guys. HD. That's what that's the world we live in now. HD. Totally HD. Um all right. This is an all-in-one. Wow, that's so cool. From Amiga to Atari. The retro emulation console based on Raspberry Pi 3 comes fully assembled. Do you believe that, guys? A Raspberry Pi 3. Fully assembled. That means they took it out of the case or out of the little plastic bag and they slipped it in to that plastic case. Dude, this guy is a hacker. He is a, he is a Raspberry Pi hacker. All right. It can also function as your media center with pre installed media center. Cody, formerly known as XBMC, an award winning, free, and open source software media center for playing videos, music, pictures, and more. Okay, so this guy's going legit. No ROMs are included. So he's kind of like, it will play. It will play, but you got to do it. And then how much is he selling us for? Wow. Can you believe that, guys? We get, check this out a Raspberry Pi fully set assemble and a 32 gigabyte SD card and two SNES controllers. Let's do the math on that. Uh, it's about $50 for the Pi and the Canna kit, probably about $12, $13 for the, for the controllers and $10 for the SD card. That to me adds up to around $60, $70 and he wants to start his bid at 140. Awesome, dude. Yeah, best deal. Best, eBay is the best place to get deals. Really good, really good stuff. Um, what else we got here? All right. Um, Raspberry Pi 3, message board chat file sharing anonymous. Get the hot new tech device. Guys, hot new tech device. The Raspberry Pi 3. It's brand new since when did it release? Wow. It's so new, guys. It's only over a year old. Yeah, it's so new, it's, it's, it's a year old. Yeah, so the, the latest, definitely the latest. You can also connect an external battery. Wow, the AC connection on it is like the connection on Android phones. Wow, do you see this explanation here? 4chan private box, stick it in your locker at school. Do you hear that? Stick it in your locker at school. <laughs> okay, all right. Use at a local message system in your neighborhood. Start a private social media like board. A private social media like board. Possibilities are endless, guys. Features. Live multi-user chat interface. What? File upload and public file sharing. Message board system. Similar to 4chan, guys. Keep it on the DL. Works with needing internet access. Create a local Wi-Fi hotspot that allows anyone to connect and use the private box interface. Includes quick set of instructions and S G <laughs> and eight gigabyte thing. I don't know what you're buying with this. Who knows what you're buying with it? What is it? Okay, there we go. Private box. Ah, okay, so it does the private box. Look at that case. So cool. Eighty nine dollars. Just just you know, eighty nine dollars, guys. All right, here we go. Raspberry Pi recall box. Okay, preloaded. Uh oh, here's another one. What do we got there? How many pages do we got of this? 1,800. How many pages is that? Oh, here's another one. Starter kit. Okay, that doesn't seem like it's too much. Oh, I'm sure it's... Uh, yeah, you're buying the dream. That's for sure, dude. You're buying the dream. Okay, the LCDs, yeah. I, I'm not sure what the cost is on, on those LCDs. That might bring... The, this is that sponsored post again. They really want us to buy that. Okay. Um, Seven inch touchscreen, Raspberry Pi accessory. Again, this, this doesn't give you the Pi. This is just for accessories. Jeez, what a ripoff. Educational programming kit. Yeah, I don't know much about that. And what the value of that is. Okay. Uh, items for page is 50. And if there's 1,800, that means there's 20 pages. So let's, let's, do Raspberry Pi 3 preloaded. And then we just opened an, a new one recently, right? Okay, this one. Raspberry Pi 3 model B 32 gig game console kit preloaded recall box plus two controllers. And you get to pick your power adapter. $16 does 
delivered from China. Great. So that'll take uh, how long? Oh, okay, great. I'll get it May 25th. Great. I'll get it in two. I'll get it in somewhere between two and six weeks. Great. That's a great little uh, delivery window you got there. Cool. Oh, I can go on Amazon and get it tomorrow? Oh, great. Cool. Okay. Raspberry Pi 3 Model B 32 gig game console equipped preloaded recall box. Two controllers. Memory card has been pre-installed recall box system. Um, Raspberry Pi 3 main board. Da, da, da. But see, it doesn't say whether it comes with games or not. And knowing that it's coming from China and there's probably a language barrier, you're probably looking at Wow, look at that, guys. You get a laptop when you buy the Pi 3. You get a laptop. How cool. And how about these controllers? Instead of X, Y, Z, you get one, two, three, four, guys. One, two, three, four. Look at that. And one of those little cheap plastic cases. What kind of feedback do these people have? 99.7. Has anybody bought this? Yeah, I don't even think they've ever sold one before. Yeah, I bet it's bad. XYZ is Xbox. Okay, so it's XO. What's on a PlayStation? XO, V. Okay, this guy's never even sold one before. What's it called? Wow, look at this one, guys. $200 or best offer. We got to check this one out. Okay, so that was that one. Okay, so we did that. We did that. We did that. We did that. I wanted to look at this one. Okay. $200, people. $200. Five views per hour. Two sold. Two sold in the last 24 hours. What is going on here? What is going on? Okay. Two sold. Two sold. This is the last one. What is it that you're, wow, look at those launch screens. Look at those launch screens, how cool. Somebody, before, after, do you see that? What he's showing us here, people? This is before, and this is after with the loading screen. You see that? That's what you're getting with $200. That's what you're getting, $200. Two sold, yeah, two sold, okay. Wow, you will receive, check this out. Check out this deal, check it out. One 32 gigabyte SD card with the custom, not even 4.2, 4.1 operating system preloaded with 17 consoles and 7,238 games. We're gonna get the Raspberry Pi 3. You're gonna get a Pi case. Who knows what Pi case you're gonna get? You're gonna get a Pi case, an HDMI cable. You know how those are expensive. And a power cord and two SNES USB controllers. Okay, so based on our, our math on the previous one, this is maybe $80. All brand new, maybe if that I'm being generous, maybe probably sixty, seventy dollars for all the, and you're buying wholesale, maybe even cheaper. And what is he selling this for? Two hundred dollars. I feel ashamed repeating this. Two hundred dollars. Who who buys this? What's going on, people? A thirty-two gigabyte. In <laughs> okay. All right. I thought his name was Cancer. I was like, that makes more sense. But okay, it's Sensei. If it's Cancer, I'd think that was more appropriate. The guy loves it. The guy loves it. He's like, awesome. Thanks. People like getting ripped off. Okay, so here's the moral. Here's the moral of this stream. We got it. We have a theory. And here's the theory. People like to get ripped off. People like to get ripped off. It's not okay for them to get ripped off. That's the point. It's not okay to get ripped off. And yeah, it's not okay. This guy sold three of them. He upped his prices. He went from uh, 160, what's the $160 one? To 200, he sold two, so at 160, what was he selling? He raised his prices. He raised his prices. He, so, he used to sell it for 160 back in March, and now, in the last month, he's selling it for 200. People, 
fast shipping, great product, great seller works like a charm. NES Classic can blow me. Dude, this costs twice as much as the NES Classic. I don't know what he's talking about. Okay, all right. Yeah, yeah, everyone's like trying to be nice to these people. Yeah, I agree that people don't wanna make it themselves, they wanna hand deliver to them. That's crazy, that's crazy. That's just, it's crazy to me that they're, they're selling for $200, like, come on. But I mean, there's a risk, right? Triple boot, Retropie, Cody, Rasp Raspian. Okay, preloaded. Let's see what, what's going on there. Octopi. Like, seriously, why would you charge? Okay, what, you know, back on the $200 one, we did the math. You know, you're only getting uh, about $60 worth of stuff. So you're saying it's justified to have a hundred, have a two to three time markup, three to two time over markup for writing an image, for putting an SD card in your computer, writing it, packaging it up, and shipping it out. Okay. Yes, that's that's the that's the issue there. Okay. I I feel a little bit better for Dr. Google. Dr. Drugles is a little less on my hate list for the five dollar chart. So he said his is a seven dollar chart. So basically, Dr. Drugle over here has the nine thousand. His is nine thousand games for seven dollars, and this guy is only 7,000 games for $200. And I know he's also giving you a uh, Raspberry Pi, so you, you gotta account for that. Okay, yes, but uh, wow. There's a can of kit Raspberry Pi 3 with them powered out of 30 and NES case. Uh, that seems about right. You can price that out yourself on Amazon too. There's an Amazon case. It's 20 bucks. So the case is 20. Raspberry Pi 3, can of kit, 50 bucks. So it's about 70 bucks. And then the 32 gigabyte card is 10. So 77, 79 is about the same price you'd get on Amazon. So there you go. Person in chat named Rafade. Okay. Cool. All right. So. A, the reason for making this video was A, to just kind of shed some light on what's going on on eBay. And if you know a friend, tell a friend to not do it, to not do it. Don't do this. Stop doing it. It's, it's free to do. Do it yourself. Um, but it ended up being pretty, pretty, pretty crazy what's out there. Jesus, I wasn't expecting so much. But anyways, I thought it was kind of funny what people are trying to, you know, pawn off. I'm sure this happens in every, you know, every, this just happens to be with retro gaming and, and uh, Raspberry Pi 3. You know, it's just like with like, they're in the play, like basketball playoffs are going on right now. And people make like the fake shirts that are like, because if you buy the official shirts, they're like $40 and you buy these ones, it's like 20. I get that because you're getting like a physical thing, but like this is pretty crazy. But uh, I, I agree with the chat that some people want uh, they want something pre-installed, pre-configured, and plug and play, which is great. I just people that are selling it for two hundred dollars though, that's despicable. That's that's crazy. Um, but now you guys know. Watch the videos. Do it yourself. DIY forever. Um, I did want to make a quick stream. I was hoping to play some Quake. I'm sorry it didn't work out. Um, but this hopefully this helped. Uh, maybe make your Friday a little bit better. Hope you're all doing well. Hope you enjoyed the videos this week. We've got some more next week, making some images. I know, I know. If you write 200, 128 gigabyte uh, a day, <laughs> you'd be a millionaire by Tuesday. Yeah, if you get enough people uh, to do it. Uh, but steer your friends to videos like these where you can do it yourself and uh, keep it open source, keep helping the community. Hopefully people like myself, Matt Little Pixel, EPA Prime, some other people out there, you know, educate people that, you know, it's easy to install Kodi. It's easy to install noobs. It's easy to install Raspbian. 
You know, these are really easy stuff to do. Do not be intimidated. Do it yourself. It just feels better and you, you don't have to pay for it. And the time, I mean, we're doing these in videos that take us 10 minutes. And a lot of that does take 10 minutes. Writing an image, you could do that in the background when you're doing other stuff. You know, you could, I just, I write an image, I'm checking my email, I'm doing other things on my computer. You know, putting it in, configuring the controls, you're gonna have to do that anyways when you get it. So I agree, Darth, DIY for the win. With that, I hope you guys all have a great weekend. I got some new videos coming up. If you like this, give it a little like. If you wanna to subscribe to the channel, that would be cool too. And we'll see you on the next one. Later chat, later Darth, later Streety, Rafade, Council Freak Anthony, thanks for coming in. J Destroyer 97, Jayster Baby, Paps Oban isn't in here now, but I knew you were in here earlier. Appreciate it. Joe was in here on his commute home. Appreciate that, even though we didn't work out earlier. 321, My Destiny, thanks for coming in. Scott, thanks for coming in, having a good time with us. Um, got him, bro. Thank you. Uh, Darth and Flipside, thank you all. Enjoy the rest of your evenings.